well. Surprise, surprise. Um, I just, I'm mean, like, I don't know what to do, okay? Like, shit is hitting the fan. So, I was going to make a video about this, the Diva Cup. It's a menstruating cup. So, like an alternative so you don't use as much waste. And so I was going to do that whenever I got my period next. But I just got it right now. And like it's Christmas Eve and I'm doing vlogs for other videos right now. And so now I want to vlog this. I mean, really, it is a quick video. I mean, I'm not making it quick because I'm trying to rant about this, but I've been wanting to do this for a really long time because it's just creates less trash and then it's just easier to me. So we're going to try it out. I'm going to put it in. I'm going to... And hopefully it goes well. So... At least I'm a very flexible person and then I'll put it in and I'll talk about it whenever. Okay, bye. Okay, so if you want to know what it comes with, it comes with this little bag. So it can be like, you can like put it in this and take it on the go. And it comes with directions, I guess, which, thank god, I don't need that. And then it comes with a cup and okay, so let's put it in. Um, I think I finally did it. I think I finally got it in and it's comfortable. I mean I'm like trying not to get way too TMI about this, but I feel like that might help actually some people so if you're trying this and if You're trying this and you're a virgin then it'll probably Hurt more I guess like because it was hurting until I, um, until it, like, unwrapped. Because, you know, you have to fold it and then put it in. And then it unfolds to, you know, match the outlining. Um, yes, I did some more research and stuff like that. And I hope it goes well. And also, I am scared that it's just gonna, like, keep going up and then I won't be able to get it out. But, you know... They say that the vagina is only three to four inches, like, deep, so I guess it can't be that bad, right? But I don't have long fingers. I do not have long fingers at all. Well, we'll see how it goes. Okay, guys, uh, it's going pretty good with the Diva Cup. Um, it's kind of uncomfortable, like, I can kind of feel it. Uh, but that's mostly because I probably didn't put it, you know, far in enough. Uh, also, um, God, I can't get my thinking straight. Like, the party just ended. <laughs> but there hasn't been any leakage. And, um, try, like, I'm, I still have that thought, like, what if it goes too far in? in that thought in my head but I really don't think there's going to be a problem with it and I can't let fear stop me from trying to do this because this is something that I really would like to do because if I can get this going good then I will no longer have to wear tampons or pads and I won't have to keep all these underwears that I don't like like I mean I usually wear you know underwear that you can't wear like put a pad on like thongs and cheekies and all that stuff that because they're more comfortable to me that's why I wear them they're more comfortable so with this and like if it's, as long as there's no leakage like I'm sure once in a while I'll mess up and there will be some leakage but this is day one and it's been pretty good and I'm taking this one in a positive note and yeah so, let's keep going. Okay, so I took it out and emptied it for the first time. And it went well. I mean, it hurt taking it out. But then, there was no leaking the entire time I had it in. 
and at some points I literally couldn't feel it at all so it's going good and I <laughs> I still have that thought that it's gonna go too far in still but I'm trying to move past it I'm trying to keep in my mind that people use this product like as an official thing and that I don't I shouldn't be worrying about that because you know so many people use it all the time so of course it's nothing bad can really happen so it's going good and I'm happy I'm content with what's happening currently now for one of the biggest tests sleeping in it so I'm gonna sleep in this and then I'll give you an update in the morning and we'll go from there I hope it goes good let's do it let's just do it Good morning, uh, I slept in it all night and it didn't spill at all and I mean I had a little hard time getting it out this morning but no it was fine like but also I feel like people who don't really care for messes then like if you're grossed out by like your menstruating blood and everything that maybe this isn't the <laughs> thing for you but I'm not so it's fine for me which is great <sighs> it's going so good like better than what I thought it would go so it's we're good we're going good now I'll just update you on this whenever something bigger happens now that like the first day is done so, stay tuned. Okay, let me talk about this really quick because this is actually way past the time that I did the Diva Cup thing because I'm terrible at vlogging. I know. But, um, so I was editing the video and I never did a, a finishing clip. So I just want to talk about it, like my overall thing. Uh, I kept it the entire time. I was on my period and there was like no spills the entire time it was really like I know I say this a lot through the rest of the video but yeah there was no spills and if you get it right uh, it's actually really comfortable and I mean if you're a virgin I feel like it would hurt at first but after a while it didn't hurt and once you get it in it doesn't hurt and it was great and it, but just the by the end of the week I was so tired of dealing with it and it's not because the actual diva cup and like situation was hard to deal with but it was just like the timing was terrible like Christmas was happening and I was trying to film other videos for other vlogs, my Christmas vlogs, that's why I never finished the fifth day, which is going to be coming out soon. I'm going to try and get that out whenever I can. Uh, but, so that's why that's been postponed, because I had to deal with that, and I wanted to get, like, this video up, and then I was also adopting my cat during this time, and all the parties, and I was on break from school right then, and it was just like, it was the worst timing ever to have happened like that and it so that was difficult but I did it and I feel like with the more experience the more easier it'll be and it'll just get better from here and I'm happy that I did it I'm happy that I bought it I'm happy that I finally experienced it I'm going to definitely keep going with it and just get used to it so it's easier and then hopefully I won't have to use anything like tampons or pads again. And my film's here, so I'm gonna wrap it up. But hi, I have to I have to wrap up my vlog, okay? So like, comment, share, and subscribe because I have to go now. My family's just got home. Okay, bye.